All right. We have a completely naked frame. Um, I've uh, taken off all of the suspension. Everything steering. And uh, now we're ready to clean up and uh, sandblast it. And uh, then we'll get it repainted. All right, so I've been sandblasting on the frame for a few days now and have learned a lot. Um, this is what I'm using as our sandblasting unit. Uh, thanks to my buddy Dave, who loaned it to me. I believe it's a 40 pounder. And I started off with uh, slag, uh, coal slag media that I purchased for like 10 bucks for a 50 pound bag. And I ran out of that and uh, decided I would give uh, sand a try. And um, you'll see in the later in the video um, where I'm picking that up locally and running it through a screen. And it's working fantastic. You can't beat the price. Um, so I'm going to show you in a minute here. Try to hold camera in one hand, not get full of sand. And um, just how it comes off. But it, it cleans it off really nice. It's kind of slow going, but... Um, it is doing a great job, so pretty pleased with it. So I live on the Mississippi River, and periodically the Corps of Engineers has to dredge it, and they bump it up on the ground, the mainland, and uh, it's free for the taking. So what I'm doing is uh, just scooping it up, popping it into, uh, through a screen into my pail, and it works great in the sandblaster from there. All right, so you can get a kind of a sense there of just how great this is working out. Um, I think it's a lot more about the um, uh, CFM 
than it is about the actual media that I'm using. Um, I'm, I'm using a really big air compressor. I think it's 100 gallons, and I think it's upwards of uh, 20 um, uh, CFM. So um, when, when it runs low, and it, it runs nonstop to keep up, but when it runs uh, low, if I'm going for a really long time, um, I can tell the difference. And I initially started off with my little 30 gallon, six CFM unit air compressor, and it, uh, it just didn't work very well at all. So um, bigger is better.